professional over here. Hi. Taste test. Happy Friday everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today I'm wearing this Ralph Lauren knit that I actually purchased in last week's video. I'll insert a clip of me unboxing it here. Now I've been eyeing off this knit for so long I finally just took the plunge and bought it today. This is what I bought. I'm so excited. How cute is this? I love the white. So I'm loving the knit. This is actually the first day of me wearing it and it fits like a glove. It's actually a lot warmer than I would have thought as well. I actually wore a singlet underneath before and then I changed because it's actually quite, yeah, it keeps you quite warm, which is good for winter. So I thought I would start the video here. Without further ado, let's have some fun this weekend and I'll bring you guys along for the journey. Last week I won an Instagram giveaway and I thought I would unbox it with you guys because I received it by mail. It's from a company called Wrapping Kit which specializes in creating kits for you to essentially you know, wrap your gifts for your family, for your friends, for your loved ones. And I think it's such a great idea. I'll leave their Instagram handle here. Definitely give them a follow. So let's open it up and see what I got a part of the giveaway. So exciting and such a unique brand as well. Like I love seeing brands that do things a bit differently. That's what I'm all about. And I actually teach my clients how to do that in their career and in their business too. So I'm obsessed with everything this brand stands for. So let's have a look. Oh my gosh, how gorgeous is this? And it came with a little note addressed to me. It says, to Chelsea, congratulations. We hope you love wrapping a special gift with our kit. I definitely will. And it has the brand's philosophy on the back as well, which is just great. So I love that they have instructions too on how to actually wrap things up. Be sure to follow these guys over on Instagram. I cannot wait to gift something to a family member or a friend using this kit. I mean, I love the colors as well. They're so Frenchy. So I feel like this is just so, so fitting. A big shout out to Wrapping Kit. And yeah, thought I would just share an unboxing with you guys. Let me know if you want to see more of these kinds of unboxing videos or even hauls on my channel too. Now it's time for me to go and grab a coffee. I'm meeting up with mum, which I usually do on a Friday. So let's go get caffeinated. It's around 6 p.m. and I'm heading off to dinner to a restaurant called Ciao Cello in Port Melbourne. It's an Italian restaurant and as you guys know, I'm pasta obsessed, so I'll definitely be getting a bowl of pasta for dinner. I'm all rugged up though because it's freezing here in Melbourne. It feels like winter, honestly. So I've got this Burberry Parker on that I bought a few years back now. It would have been in probably 2017 I would like to say so almost four years ago it's definitely a classic and keeps me nice and warm so I'll bring you guys along and show you what I get for dinner Saturday everyone. I'm actually heading out to grab dinner with my friend Jess. It's 4.30 but we're having an early dinner because we're going roller skating tonight. I believe they've turned like a car parking lot in the city into a roller skating rink which will be lots of fun. Fun fact, I used to love rollerblading when I was younger so I feel like this is very nostalgic and something different to do on a Saturday night. So first we're going to get Greek food from Stella Sites, an iconic Melbourne restaurant and then we'll go roller skating. I'll bring you along for the fun. Hey! Professional over here. Oh, there we go. Happy 
Sunday fun day guys. I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing today, which is a full outfit from Scanlan Theodore. I've got this top on, which I bought quite a while back. I knew it was one of those pieces that was just so different. I had to invest in it. And I love the color combination of the pink and the red. I think it's very retro and preppy. And then I've got this black pleated skirt on also from Scanlan Theodore with my white sneakers from Gucci. So that's the look for today. Now on the agenda for today is to basically just hang out with my family. I've got my parents in the city this weekend because it's the Labor Day long weekend. So we have the Moomba Festival on in Melbourne, which did go ahead, which is so great to see. I did miss out though, because they've ticketed it this year just to kind of, you know, make sure there's a cap on how many people are there for social distancing reasons. So I did miss out. Hopefully next year I can go to Moomba because I think it's so much fun going on the rides and just having that you know carnival atmosphere in the middle of the city it's really cool so I might just walk past and see what's happening either today or tomorrow and I'll keep you guys posted with that as well but now it's coffee time hi guys I'm here with mum hey mum and we're just about to go and get a coffee where should we go um, oh, that's a good question I don't know <laughs> um, <laughs> that is so helpful. <laughs> Maybe the sensory lab. We'll yes, try. let's go to sensory lab. You guys know it's an old favorite of ours and the coffee is always good. So yeah, yep. we'll go there. And there are quite a few people in the city this weekend because of the Moomba Festival. So it's good to see the city is quite busy again. I mean, we haven't seen it like this in a long time. Not necessarily right now where we're walking. It's pretty quiet, but it is a Sunday morning and it's quite early, so we are early birds. Early birds catch the worm and get the good coffee. Monday everyone it's around 10 a.m. and I'm about to head out to grab a coffee so far my long weekend has been really nice we have a public holiday today so I'm actually catching up with some friends for dinner tonight and we might have a walk around and see what's happening for the last day of Moomba but it's been a really restful long weekend I've also managed to catch up with a lot of family and friends so I just feel like Melbourne is finally feeling like it's normal self again. It's so good to see people out in the city and just everyone's so happy after the past, you know, year or so, like we all just needed this. So it's been a really great weekend. And in terms of what's on for this morning, I'll go grab a coffee. I've just been cleaning up around the house. So my apartment is nice and clean for the week ahead now. And I'll probably get stuck into some work this afternoon just before I head out for dinner because I do have a big week at Frenchie HQ. I'm in the middle of launching a new program called the Glow Getter Mentorship. So if you're looking to excel in your career or in your business through goal setting principles and my success formula then follow the link below to sign up anyway it's time to get caffeinated so let's get going and in terms of my outfit of the day today I'm wearing this Marge jumper in leopard print super cute and warm and then I've got this Marge necklace on with the letter C my page denim jeans and my Chloe neutral flats so that's my look for today just got our coffee from Duke's coffee so good chin chin <laughs> our kind of cheers and it's pretty quiet this morning in the city although there were a few people having brekkie on de grave street but the rest of the city seems quiet i think everyone's having a bit of a sleep in this morning being a long weekend it's just so nice though to have this atmosphere back in the city again and even when we went to dukes like to see so many people inside it's just so nice like Melbourne needs this and yeah we're finally slowly getting back to normal taste test so good gotta love Melbourne coffee cheers now so many of you guys ask me for my coffee recommendations for brunch recommendations I definitely recommend trying Duke's coffee on Flinders Lane there are quite a few good cafes on Flinders Lane actually there's Brunetti there's journal which is next door to Duke's there is what else is there 
and then if you go on to De Grape Street, there's Tulip Coffee, so that's definitely a good area to really sample Melbourne's finest coffee. So we're just at Combi in Elwood, which is a beautiful plant-based cafe. We've ordered some smoothies. How cute is this? I used to come here all of the time, but it's so good to be back. Haven't been here in ages. It's smoothie time. How good does this look? We got our smoothies from Combi and they're in a peanut butter flavor. I love this little slogan too because I believe all of their food is raw vegan and so delicious and the straw has bees on it. Super cute. So cheers guys. It's around 2 p.m. and I wanted to show you guys what I bought from Scanlan Theodore yesterday. I actually included a clip of me trying on this fluffy white cardigan. It's much like the material that I'm wearing with this Marge jumper. It's a white cardigan. I've got it here with me. So let me show you because it is super cute and a classic piece. You guys know that I love investing in timeless, high quality pieces because they're the ones that you're going to, you know, get a lot of wear out of and you're going to have them for a long time. So that's what I bought yesterday. I love it so much, how cute. Oh my gosh, it's so dreamy and just so pretty to wear, so soft. And I think it's just so versatile. It goes with, you know, a pleated skirt or high-waisted pants jeans you know you could even wear it just like cropped or even with like a crop top underneath and wear it open so it's a really gorgeous cardigan now when i tried it on i unbuttoned a few of the buttons and i found that that gave it quite you know a fun and more casual look but it's very Scanland have a lot of like professional corporate wear so it's going to be very bold and you know going to make you stand out in the workplace or in your job whatever you do for work you know that's why i love their clothes because i find you know as somebody who's very creative and you know works for themselves i find that it helps me step into that boss mode because it's really empowering i love their range and i'm slowly starting to build a collection with them so that's the beautiful cardigan I also have, yeah, matching skirt to go with it. Not matching, but I have a pleated skirt from Scanland that I actually tried this on with and it went so well. So, you know, that's another thing. Slowly build up your wardrobe and slowly invest in those key pieces and you'll find that in years to come, you will have that wardrobe that you've wanted. It just takes time and I found that for myself, but slowly, slowly you do build it up and yeah, just wanted to show you guys, super cute. The sleeves cuff as well, and you can roll it up too for a more, you know, just like kind of, I guess like an effortless look as well. So I really can't wait to wear this and to show you guys. I think one of the mannequins even had like a belt with this Cardi. So yeah, that's what I bought yesterday from Scanlan Theodore, which is an Australian designer in case you didn't know. I am going to leave this video here now though, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate your support for my YouTube channel. Don't forget to click subscribe as well and to share this video with a friend. Sharing is caring. So if you know somebody who, you know, loves Melbourne as much as I do, or maybe they love their designer clothes or just lifestyle content in general, definitely share this video with them. It would mean the absolute world to me. So thank you guys so much. And leave a comment below. I would love to get to know you. Tell me a bit about yourself, where you're from, you know, why you enjoy these videos and how I can create content for you as well. Thank you guys and I'll see you very soon. Bye. Do you feel lonely in a prison, darling? I know I'm still stuck somewhere in your head.